Hi and welcome to this track parts tutorial. In this video we will show you how to replace a V-string on small Isegi tractors. These are the tools and parts you need to get the job done. A water pump plier, a wrench and of course a new V-string. Looking for the right parts for your tractor? We have more than 14,000 parts in stock and worldwide shipping. Please visit trackparts.com and find the parts you need. New to this channel? Please subscribe, hit the bell and get notified to new videos. Alright, let's get started. First of all, remove the engine cover of the tractor and find out where the V-string is located. Tip: It is important to carefully consider whether the radiator needs to be removed or whether you can easily replace the V-string. And always look at how a part fits before you remove it. The V-string is wound on and off with the adjusting support of the alternator. Loosen the bolt of the alternator where it sits on kind of a sled that looks like a half-shaped moon. Push the alternator slightly forward on the carriage so that the tension of the V-string is released. Then remove the V-string. In this case the V-string can be removed without removing the radiator. Take the new V-string and put the belt first around the crankshaft and the water pump pulley and finally around the alternator. When you have checked that the V-string is in the right position and not twisted, tension it by moving the dynamo forward again. You determine the correct tension for a V-string by pressing on it. This should give about 7 to 10 millimeters. When you have determined the correct tension, retighten the bolt on the alternator. Place the engine cover back on the tractor and that's it, you replace your V-string. Need more tips? Watch our other videos and share the knowledge. Thanks for watching this track pass tutorial, until next time.